Well, hello and welcome back to NDI Central Live at NAB 2018. We're here in the South Hall of the Las Vegas Convention Center, webcasting directly to you from the New Tech booth. If you're visiting NAB in the next couple days, make sure you stop by and see us. Get a close personal look at the latest in NDI technology and new tech products, as well as other great products uh, utilizing NDI technology. Well, we're always very excited when we hear about uh, users really embracing the concept of NDI. And uh, our next guest uh, certainly has done that. Uh, Jim Robinson, the supervising uh, senior producer from the Weather Company, an IBM company, better known as the Weather Channel. Uh, yep. <laughs> What we is it, lot. Weather Channel, Weather Company? Yeah, it's a little confusing. Uh, so IBM acquired us back in 2016, two years ago now. Jeez, it's been that long. Uh, so essentially, this is the digital properties. It's uh, Weather.com, the Weather Channel app, which we have downloaded, right? Do you have yours? Um, no. Not uh -huh. yet. Uh -huh. I, I see will. how this works. I promise. <clears throat> so essentially, we're making video for uh, for the digital properties of the Weather Channel brand. Okay. Um, and then Weather Group, which is a separate television network, is owned by Weather Group. Okay. Weather Group, just said that. Uh, so different company, but we're still under the same brand, and that's okay. how that works. It's a, it's a little confusing at first. You're the app and the dot .com. Dot .com, that's okay, right. Okay, very good. Yeah. And so why an app? Why not? Why not? I app? mean, it's in everybody's pocket. That's true. Uh, I mean, I, I don't know how much video I consume uh, every any given day uh, uh, from my phone, and we, you good know, point. we realize that people are like the. Listen, this is not going away. <laughs> it's only going to get better. So what you have to do is... And it's not just a phone. Uh, no, no. It's, <laughs> it, it, it literally is a computer in your pocket. But you, know, you really have to produce content that's specifically for these small screens. Mm -hmm. Small. I know. They're getting, in, you know, they're getting huge. Um, but that's, that's our whole thing. You know? like we want to be able to deliver some, you know, the, the life-saving stuff that's really going to be vital to anybody who likes weather or who isn't impacted by weather, which is... Everybody. Yeah. <laughs> so, <laughs> and a uh, a main topic when uh, the conversation gets uncomfortable. R right, right. <laughs> it's really dry out here, Rex. It's really dry. It What's, dry. What do we do about that? Uh, but no, I mean, it's literally the, the starting point of every conversation. That's right. Uh, especially, you know, I mean, you and I, of course, have to talk about your model, <laughs> which, by the way, is awesome. Yes, our diorama. Uh, uh, that is so cool. Our, I, our I is an uh, did you guys see this? Look at He's got a jumbotron. That's <laughs> with right. Old fit, with well, it's actually said, it's a drive-in movie theater. Oh, my God. That's the them? best. Yes, <laughs> it is awesome. He's got fit, was it, like 50 style movies in there. That's Right, we've got trailers from uh, old uh, B movie horror movies, and oh. then you've got first of all you get the Las Vegas sign, and then you've got the tarantula somewhere in there too, <laughs> which is just like awesome. Tomorrow it's so scorpions, cool. tarantula. There's now, our scorpions, tarantula cam. Scorpions don't climb, right? They're they're gonna <laughs> they're gonna stay. Yeah, they're do gonna tarantulas stay climb low, or? Oh well, yeah, they're they're they've been all over the plexiglass. I will not be staying around very long, yeah. but uh, it was people great have to been see horrified you by <laughs> yeah. our display. Yeah. <laughs> So, okay, so um, so a dot com and an app, where does video fit into all this? So the video is actually, um, we have a ton. So you think about the Weather Channel app as just being like, this is where I get my forecast. And I can tell that there's a high wind watch from, uh, for, uh, for, for Wednesday uh, in the Las Vegas uh, area. Um, but we are the ones who are creating the video inside the app. So if I tap on that, I have playlists, and every video in here uh, is what we're responsible for. So this is everything from a forecast to viral videos to you know uh, weather adjacent topics. Uh, it could be anything from you know the the latest spring outlook is coming, and uh, you know the the hurricane outlook's coming. Is it going to be a busy one? And so um, we're doing we're doing a lot uh, inside the app itself. It's not just the data. Um, we are the B to C side of 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 the company, so okay. we're really excited to be able to do that. Okay. Doing it for a while now. Now, you've uh, designed or built a new studio facility, correct? Dos. Two. <laughs> Two, yeah. Two new facilities. <laughs> Okay. So when we separated from Weather Group, uh, when IBM acquired us, uh, about, you know, two years ago, um, we uh, moved over to uh, Brookhaven, Georgia, which is just up the street from uh, the 300 building, and we were given an, a great opportunity to just kind of start from scratch, and it gave us a chance to 
build something that was completely IP based. Uh, we knew we wanted to go in that direction before we moved. Mm -hmm. I mean, it, we were in a we were in a facility that was very high tech already, but we knew that when we were going to talk about doing video and video for the app that was going to be flexible and nimble, and we can just make things happen really quickly. We knew that we had to we had to go all in. I know it's I know it's a little, yes I I, I'm, <laughs> I realize that's the 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 tagline. I know Panasonic's doing it, um, but you know I. We wanted to we wanted to build something that was going to be very flexible. It's going to grow with us, and we were we we adopted NDI back in when was it announced? 15, 16? Yeah, I think it was six years ago. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. um, and we've been we've been on ever since, kind of watching it grow and grow and grow and get more and more great. Uh, the developers have just been awesome. Uh, always a hats off to those guys because they have just like taken that idea and just and run went with nuts with yep. it. Uh, so that's huge and we were taking advantage of all of those new little tweaks in the technology and things like that and um, we wanted to, to really break, you know, bring that into our new facility, make it all completely NDI, and it is. Mm -hmm. So when you, when you see a video signal from our camera on the app for a video that we shot with the forecast, that camera starts as, uh, it's an HDMI out of our camera, it goes, it, it, depending on what camera we're using, it goes to a Spark or it goes to uh, a con uh, an IO module. Mm -hmm right into the I.O. module and it becomes part of our video network. Okay. And so then our engineers can go in, they can use the I.O. modules as a video routing system. And it's great. <laughs> like, it's a virtual video router and just about anybody can log in, make a couple adjustments, and we've suddenly, we're suddenly, we're, we're feeding, you know, a, a completely different source or a, an Emmy that we've created with some 3D animation or, or something like that inside our giant 9 by 15 foot video wall that's uh, all LED and just awesome. And so the great thing is everything everything inside of our studio is it confidence monitors underneath the cameras like the one you have here mm -hmm. everything is powered by an NDI source period that's it, it, it was the, the 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 idea that we could do that today is I, I never would have saw that. I mean, I, never. I mean, I, well, then again, I, I didn't expect that we'd ever have phones with, you know, 4G LTE okay. signal either, but <laughs> here, here we are. Here we are. Um, so it's, it, it was just, we wanted to, to just dive in fully and make that just a, a, you know, a completely flexible place. So at what point did you make the decision that that was the route you were going to go? Huh. NDI versus a traditional, you know, I SDI I, and routers yeah. and all that. I remember the early talk we had um, back when it was first released. NDI was first released. Uh, I think it was pre NAB that year, um, and I, I downloaded one of the tools and I I I was playing with a laptop and I had a uh, scan converter or something. It was one of the early tools. Uh, I was kind of playing around with some ideas and I I was just uh, looking at some of the way that we some of the ways that we can create these sources. And immediately when I did that, and then I walked into another room without running any cable. I, I mean, I didn't run an SDI cable. I plugged into a port that was already there, that was already on our network, mm -hmm. and I had video. Yep. I mean, that, that was a no-brainer. I mean, to me, I was just thinking, okay, we're in a place. I'm not going to invest in a ton of money to run all these new cables. I'm literally just... Plugging and playing. When you already have the infrastructure with what I have in it. place. I already have it in place. And by the way, what you just described can be done by anyone watching now by going to newtech.com and uh, downloading NDI tools. Yeah. Because in it, you've got a uh, <laughs> several different tools to be able to test out and try out NDI right There's on your it. own system. You've got the, the color bar generator, right. which is awesome. And <laughs> video monitor. Yeah, of course. The new improved studio monitor. Yeah, yeah, exactly. I mean, listen, the, the tools keep getting better and better. Your partners are doing great work. They're, they're also running with it. I yeah. talked to several, and they, uh, it's, well, a lot of the graphics uh, companies, developers, are really, in love with it because yeah. they've just eliminated the need for a whole lot of hardware right. to get that signal, right. you know, pass through the switcher or route it to wherever it needs to go. Displays. Yeah. Well, I mean, you look at you look at VizRT. Mm -hmm. I mean, they they uh, there was a, a an upgrade somewhere in our system that they turned on NDI, and it's like, wait a second, <laughs> what do we have here? Yeah. And we can trigger macros with it and, and things like that. And now you've got your own box, which is awesome. But you know that that was like the early stage for me to say, okay, we are on to something. We just need to keep getting the word out. <laughs> you know, like we need more adopters. Come on, get it and yeah. get it into your systems. Uh, so, you know, it, it it just it's 
it's so amazing. What do you think uh, is the biggest advantage of uh, going all NDI in your system? The fact that I can make any source out of anything. Mm. I mean, I have a. I keep bringing my phone, and I apologize, guys. Um, the you know the app. There's a there's an app. There's the the camera app. Um, if I'm if I'm on the Wi-Fi network that my NDI network is on, I now have a camera that's mobile in my studio, and I have a now a, a camera that you know if I can hit the Wi-Fi from just outside the building, now I'm a live camera outside. It's just you know that a lot, a lot of flexibility in in terms of you don't really have to think about it. It's just no, kind of there, just there. Yeah, that's fine. And it just works, which is great. Yeah. So where so what's next? You build two studios out. Um, we what's, conquer what's, the world together, well, yeah, Rex. What's, come what's on. Coming on. <laughs> <laughs> you know, we are, the biggest thing that we are focused on this year. One of the biggest things we have a lot of big things we're focusing on. But one of the uh, biggest things we're working on is live streaming on the app. Mm -hmm. uh, you may have seen there. We did earlier this year. We did a, uh, a, lo a lunar eclipse. It was yes. a full lunar eclipse. Which In fact, I think awesome. we have a, a clip of some oh, of that coverage. Oh, that's great. Yeah. So this is us. Um, we. Uh, by the way, that viz graphic is powered by an NDI channel. Nice. Um, and the camera is all NDI. Everything you're seeing, that, that moonshot from the Griffith Observatory, NDI, it's a, it was a, um, a direct feed into one of our I.O. modules. It was an HLS stream. And this was, look at everything in that studio is, is all powered by an NDI signal. Everything. Fantastic. Every single thing. Except for the lights, which, you know, then, uh, yeah, maybe, maybe that's coming, your next might one. Be coming. <laughs> I mean, I've heard talk. Yeah, <laughs> uh, but you know, it, it's it's such a great like even see where it says uh, the lunar eclipse live on the side there. Yeah. That's all powered by an I/O module. An I/O module channel powers all of those screens. Wow. Um, and what's great is that we can actually program these and just so quickly. We don't need to have we don't need to call in a team of engineers to to push some some buttons. It, it's we we can just have this stuff ready to go and not you know. Sorry, I'm rambling, but it's great. No, it's, it's really love exciting. To, we love to hear it. All the folks back in New Tech, I'm sure, are loving to hear it. <laughs> <laughs> well, just cut this out and just publish it right away. There's your right. ad. But no, I mean, in all, in all, in all honesty, you know, we we have a job to do. We're the weather company. We're we're you know a, a very important app on people's uh, phones because of what we do. We we love what we do. We we're we're enthusiastic about science and weather, but we're also enthusiastic about keeping people safe. Mm -hmm. I hate watching any kind of video where someone is hurt from a storm that yeah. we um, had to A, tell you about, and B, uh, have to be involved with mm. after the fact. Yeah. It's terrible. Yeah. And it, but the other thing is, you know, from a storytelling standpoint, um, and I don't, I don't want to jump ahead, but um, with user-generated content, it is now a big thing. We use user-generated content like crazy. I mean, I'm talking about the stuff from like Instagram and Twitter and Facebook and you name it. We we use it. Um, but because so many of these uh, users are turning on a phone, they are now a live you know a, a live bureau <laughs> all over the country yeah. and all over the world. Yep. Um, you know, I, I I still remember watching a video from uh, a woman who was who just watched the storm come through Naples and. You know, it was just insane. You, you, you see these these people coming out, and, and it's in real time, and it's organic. You can't wow. get this. I mean, like, you can't pay someone to go and get the kind of stories you get with user-generated, uh, the social media. Um, you know, and I, she came out. She was uh, visibly upset. Her uh, her daughter was a diabetic. They couldn't get out of the house. Yep. Good luck calling 911 when yeah. 17,000 other people are on the line. Yep. And it, it's just, you know, like, it, it Real breaks your heart. stories coming from the sources. Yeah. So then what we do is, you know, we, we, we can quickly get these sources into a scan converter or directly into one of our I.O. modules if we can get the stream. And it's we're, we're turning that really fast. And it's just our storytelling has, has gone up exponentially. Wow. I mean, editorially, we are rocking it. I mean, and it's, it's because of the tools that are so flexible and let us do that. So that's great. From our, I mean, from an editorial standpoint, it's it's huge. Fantastic. Well, I really appreciate you coming on uh, NDI. Central My pleasure. Live, can we, can we show the Can we show the camera again with the tarantula? Get that uh, <laughs> weather company app <laughs> yes. right away. Download it. Please Stay download informed. it. informed. It's download important. It. Yes. Could make the difference between life or death, depending yeah. on where you live. Yeah. But uh, no, seriously. I wouldn't watch tomorrow. Just yeah. FYI. <laughs> okay. Jim, thank you so much thank for you. joining us. Good to see you. Uh, check out the Weather Channel app. Make sure you uh, download it to your mobile device. Now, don't go anywhere. We have one more uh, segment today, and uh, then we'll wrap it on up. So stick around. Don't go anywhere.